Today I'm going to show you how to check how much hard drive space is used on your computer and where it's used with a really cool utility called Winderstat. So if you just go to Google and type in Winderstat, which is W-I-N-D-I-R-S-T-A-T, and then look for the download link that's sourceforge.net. They're a very reputable place to download stuff from. Uh, and then here just click on the big green download link here and it's a very small program, it should just take a second to download um, you just have to wait three seconds for it to start downloading and then just run it and this will work on XP and Windows 7 and Vista will work on all of them So really simple to use, just hit yes there just accept these terms, hit next, hit next, install finishes pretty much instantly, just hit next and then close and then the program will open. Uh, it's very, very simple to use. It'll show all of your drives here that you have in the computer. So if you have a pen drive or something or a SD card for a camera, they'll all show up here. But the one that you're mainly concerned about is your C disk because if that one gets full, then your operating system can run really slowly. So this can really show you where all your space is used so you can find what you want to delete. Uh, if you, you can also check any other disks here, all you have to do is click on them and it'll add it to the search structure, but I'm just going to do the C disk to make it easy then just hit OK and what it's going to do is it's going to start going through when it's finished then you're going to have a window that kind of looks like this um, you'll just have those Pac-Man things moving until finally it'll finish mine took about a minute and 11 seconds to scan so it shouldn't take long uh, first you're going to see this structure this is very handy because it tells you what folders on your C drive have the most stuff in them so then you can kind of investigate where you can delete stuff to free up space so if you were thinking oh well in my case more than half of my used space is all my program files so there might be some programs that I can delete uh, so then you can go into there and you can see that pretty much all of the space on my computer that's used is in my Steam folder so that's going to be stuff that I actually don't want to delete because I play those games but uh, in your case you might have something in here like they use up a lot of space that you don't use anymore and then you could go to add remove programs and delete it uh, also because I have a lot of uh, Windows uh, operating system images and Linux operating system images things like that in my downloads folder I have a lot of space there and use there uh, this is what happens when you let your cat name your uh, name your computer um, in, you can see that most of my space here is used by my downloads folder which probably means that I can delete quite a bit of that or move it to other places um, you can see that this huge chunk down here is all just downloaded stuff um, so usually that's a folder that can be cleaned out that if you download a lot of stuff then uh, can be cleaned out over here there's a pretty useful feature as well where you can click on the different types of files and it will tell you where those are used like if I click on ISO and you can see that most of those are used in my downloads folder like if I click on downloads you can see that this big square here is all my downloads folder and then if I click on ISO it shows which are ISOs which means that most of those are in my downloads folder so that could be a useful feature for you as well but usually this file tree over here will really tell you the most about where you're able to get rid of stuff and where it's used <laughs>